So now let, let me just give you like a, like a time lapse of the computer vision field starting from the uh, early 60s and going to today. Um, so basically it started in 50s, but like the early days are considered to be in the 60s because this guy on the, on the left you can see on the screen is called Larry Roberts and he's widely considered as the father of computer vision. And in 60s, he, he wrote this seminal paper titled Machine Perception of Three-Dimensional Solids. And I won't get into more many technical details here, but I just want to mention that the idea was to take these toy examples, like line drawings and stuff, and try and extract 3D information from these drawings. So that was the, the whole point in the initial days of computer vision. We, we couldn't cope with like real imagery that's really complex. So we just tried and used uh, these uh, toy examples, uh, the so-called blocks world. So in 1966, there was this interesting, it's not a legend, it's actually a true, like a true story. Uh, Seymour Puppert, a guy from MIT, uh, gave his students um, as a task, like a, like a summer project, go and solve computer, this computer vision thing, like try and, and create like a visual system that will mimic the, the one that humans have. And like that was in 1966, like half a century later, here I am, I'm presenting to you about computer vision. We still haven't cracked this problem. It's, a, it's something that humans find really, really easy, whereas computers find it really hard. 